Um, I thought it would be lovely to share um, an old meditation that we've used a lot in the past. I love doing meditations. I love doing guided meditations for my groups and everything. It's just, just fabulous. Um, and it's great to have these guided journeys because sometimes I feel in life we need stepping stones into different realities and we need stepping stones into mindfulness. We need stepping stones into peace, into calming the mind. And sometimes um, people have often said they find it quite difficult initially to sort of quieten the mind going into the still point and the uh, no mind activity at all. So guided meditations are often a brilliant way of stepping into that half-to-half -half realm. You can partially listen to the voice of the person who's guiding you and you can come in and out as and when and you can train your mind over time for the concentration level needed to let go. <laughs> so um, a lot of my stuff will be on esoterics and etheric uh, connections and higher aspects of the soul and the cosmic links um, but I'm very 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 earthy and I feel it's really important to embody these things and bring it back into the body and never forget your physical frame so we're going to do this meditation on loving your body on loving who you are and just taking notice of what the body's doing and what it's telling you. Okay, so first of all, I'd love you to get really comfortable, really, really comfy. And, um, you know, you can sit up in a chair as I'm doing where I'm sitting a bit forward. So my back is supported by my own spine. But if you wish to, you can lay down. Uh, you might fall asleep, but that's okay. You can replay it. <laughs> um, uh, whichever is most comfortable for you. And um, if you like what's coming up, I have a little uh, MP3 connection. We'll put a link down below if you're interested in that. It's only a fiver, but if you'd like to actually have that, you can just, um, just follow the link and it will give you a full sort of 40 minute version of this shorter one I'm going to share with you now. Okay, so. If you'd like to close your eyes and take some nice deep breaths. It's really good if you can breathe in through your nose and out through your mouth. If it's comfortable to do so. You know, everything to do with life is all about not trying to be or do that thing that's asked of you. Um, by many, many people as, uh, as people are saying this is the only way or the perfect way. You know, your way is the perfect way. Your way is the right way. This is about listening to your unique signature, listening to your soul, your intuition, and your body. You know, if by my saying, breathe in through your nose and out through your mouth and you've got a cold or sinus problems and that's really difficult, what's actually going to happen is the mind's going to spend all of our session together trying to overcome the pain that you've now you've now noticed so whatever i'm saying during this meditation if you found an easier way of doing it a better way for you so you can still get the benefit from the meditation as a whole you do that follow you your way your way is best okay so take a deep breath, a few deep breaths in whichever way is best for you. So just as you're breathing, breathing in, often when we've got lots of stress in our shoulders, we tend to raise our shoulders towards our ears. So whilst you're breathing, if it's comfortable to do so, and you breathe out, when you breathe out, try and lower your shoulders down towards the floor. If you're lying down, just try and let them drop open so your chest opens up and your shoulders go down. And you just take some nice deep breaths in in whichever way is most comfortable for you and release. And now I'd like you to focus on your toes. If you'd like to crunch your toes up and then release them. 
and just say thank you, Totes, for the amazing job you do for me. And then put your focus on your feet. Wow. Say thank you to your feet. The amazing job it does for the majority of us in helping us stand and walk. Beautiful connection with earth. Just really focus and give thanks and gratitude towards your feet. For those of you that can picture a loving beam of light, send that with laser accuracy, but with warmth and cuddles and soft edges, all the way to your feet and your toes and your ankles and heels. Ah, I love you. And then if you bring your attention up your calves and your shins, noticing with some detail how the muscles respond and the bones respond to your attention that you're now putting on different parts of your body. How do those calves feel? Send that gorgeous loving energy for those without any healing experience just warmth and love and wishes of a healthy body is perfectly good enough and then bring your attention to your knees oh our knees need so much thanks we have so much to be grateful for them assisting in all our movement. Take another nice deep breath in and send some of that beautiful healing breath and light to your knees. Knees are very emotionally charged. They're an area in a healer's paradigm where we spend quite a lot of attention clearing balancing and returning to harmony, the knee area which holds a lot of your emotional intent. So by focusing during this meditation on healing your own knees, clearing, balancing, returning to harmony, it helps to clear your emotions and your way forward. Now, if you lovingly have loving thoughts towards your thighs, your strongest and longest bone in the body, your thighs, all of your buttocks and your hips, your womb area, male or female, this is still the creative centre, whatever sex you are. Bring your attention to this part of the body and send love and appreciation to the strength that your thighs give you, to the flexibility and freedom of movement during life that come from your hips, to that fantastic muscle gluteus maximus that grows up from the bottom all the way up our backs. Really send some gorgeous, loving thoughts and gratefulness to this whole area. Take some more nice deep breaths. And send this loving intent to your thighs, your hips. Relax those muscles deeply. Let go.
bring your attention now into your torso, into the center part of your abdomen and your stomach. Sending loving energy and just taking notice of your digestion in life, of your beautiful liver. It's cleansing your kidneys, adrenals, all of the systems of the spleen. Oh, really just take notice of what that whole area around your stomach and your abdomen, lower back, feels like. Say hello. I love you. Thank you. I'm grateful. Nice deep breaths in and releasing as we move your attention to your heart. Your mid thoracic back area, your rib cage, your lungs, your diaphragm. Pay some attention to this part of the body. Send your loving intent there, your thankfulness for the steady rhythm and the deepest of breathing. Nice deep breaths, appropriate here and release as you relax even more all parts of your body as you give thanks ever deeper to all parts of your body. As you remember your gratefulness of all parts of your body. Take your attention now to your shoulder area, your neck, your arms and your fabulous hands, wrists, elbows, shoulders, Oh, just realise and know all the things this part of your body does in harmony with you, for you. Much to be thankful for. Let your thankfulness grow and overflow into those areas with your loving intent and your gratefulness. Allow your shoulders to relax even more. Nice deep breath in and release. And as you release, relax your shoulders even more. Your wrists and your fingers just relax even more. Now your attention goes to your beautiful head. The strength of your neck to hold this heavy piece of miraculous invention. Send love and thankfulness to the eyes that see, the ears that hear, the mouth that talks, Lips that kiss. Just be thankful. Be aware. Relax your neck. Relax your head. Smooth all those furrows away from your face. Smile inwardly and externally, reminding yourself of a happy nature. Take some nice deep breaths in again. And on the exhalation, relax your neck even more, reminding your shoulders there's still room to relax and go deeper. All through the body, the hips will want to open more 
the knees to relax more, the feet to just be. Nice deep breath in again. And as you exhale, send this beautiful ray of light all the way from the top of your head through the whole of your body with an intention that I am well. I am healed. My body is amazing. I am truly thankful. Thank you, body. For all that you do. I am listening. Just take a moment to listen in to the whole of your body now that you've loved all different aspects of it. See if there are any messages the body wishes to convey through whispers or slight nudges or even pain. Listen to your body and as you notice differences in your body, put your loving intention there. See it as relaxed, free and healed. Align your mind with your spirit inside your body and allow the miracle that you are to take place. Take a few moments for that awareness now. And you can continue this process any time that you feel is beneficial. So take some nice deep breaths now as you become fully aware of the room that you're in or the place that you're in. Wiggle your toes again, maybe move your feet on the earth if you're sitting upright. Remind yourself that you're fully here. And we say together, I call all aspects of my soul back to me now. Just a really lovely way when you finish a guided meditation. Sometimes we go off with different thoughts and we come back into the room again and we go off and come back into the room. So by saying this three times, I call all aspects of my soul back to me now. It helps to just align us with mind, body and soul. For some of you, you might want to just put those lovely roots of energy down into the earth so you connect with her and you feel really grounded. The best way, of course, to feel grounded if you have a few moments now or can make them. A priority in life is to go out and have just a few minutes of barefoot walking on this beautiful planet of ours. Okay. So, take some nice deep breaths now as you come fully aware and open your eyes and come back to the room that you're in. Look around and make sure you feel quite with it here and now. And I hope that you feel more loved up. Give yourself a nice hug. We all need physical touch. We all need those hugs. So everyone can usually give themselves a hug in some way, shape or form or ask someone to give you a hug. Have a hug. <laughs> and with that, I hope you have a wonderful day or evening. And yeah, maybe apply yourself to this general practice or access the full meditation that goes into a lot more detail. But even a few minutes a day like we've done today, I'll help you realise how much love you can give 
yourself in a very healthy manner. I wish you well. See you soon. Soul to soul. Bye.